Your aunt Tay was hurt? Yes, sir. What were you thinking? I was thinking is it a dream. How did you think she was hurt? Because she was crying and just shaking. The first thing he told me was he was sad. And I asked him why was he sad. And he told me because the police had killed his, had shot his aunt. About my neighbor. I'm there. Well, the front doors have been open since 10 o'clock. I haven't seen anybody moving around. It's not normal for them to have the doors open this time of night. Okay. You know if anyone is inside? Well, I'm not sure. Both of the calls are there. Home at this time? Uh, they're usually home, but they never had both of the front doors open. The lights on, like I can see straight through the house. They'll have an officer come by. They're already in dispatch now, okay? Okay, I appreciate it. I mean, it's not normal for them to have both of the doors open this late that long. Outside the window. Oh, sir. I don't remember. 
Do you remember him? Do you remember seeing him at all? Outside of him? No, sir. So I started to get that second phrase out, show me your hands. I saw a silhouette. I was looking right down the barrel of a gun. And when I saw the barrel of that gun pointed at me, I fired a single shot from my duty weapon. And immediately had the the flash from the muzzle reflecting off the off the window. And of course, uh, as my weapon recoiled, the light was bouncing back in my face, so I couldn't see. When my vision cleared, then I observed the person. found the defendant Aaron York deemed guilty beyond a reasonable doubt of the offense of manslaughter, assess his punishment at confinement in the Texas Department of Criminal Justice for 11 years, 10 months, 12 days. <laughs>